feel the anointing of the Holy Ghost. And man, that's a high to me. Amen. Amen. That is Amen. A rush. Yes. Right. Amen. Holy Ghost, I can feel him right now. Mm-hmm. Oh, but Amen. I can feel him. Amen. I can feel you. Oh, old devil comes to you sometime and says, How do you know, Dennis, when you just die, that's just not it. You just can go more. I said, because I believe the Bible. Well, how do you know it's true? I said, it talks a lot about who's talking to me right now. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> if you're the one talking to me, it warns me about it. Oh, come on. Come on. Amen. Praise God. I believe God put this earth here. Amen. Amen. Good night, the stars. He flung all the stars and named every one of them. You have no idea how big this world and planet is. And every time a saint dies, we miss them. Mm -hmm. But if you went to them right now and said, hey, would you come back to this? Are you crazy? (laughs) Do you think I want to come back to this place? They ain't no way. They ain't no way. And you know what they're saying? Some of them. I remember Dennis preached about this place. Yeah. Yeah. Uh Mm Uh-huh. Yeah, and there's some people go to hell. I hope I've never preached to anyone that's went to hell because now down in hell, there's no unbelievers in hell. Mm-hmm. They're down there screaming, God, help me to get out of this place. Mm-hmm. Lord, give me a second chance. Lord, why didn't my mommy tell me about this place? Why didn't my dad warn me about this place? Why didn't I preach or preach about this place? I wouldn't be in hell tonight crying and screaming, wanting out of this place of torment if somebody would have warned me. Mm. If somebody would have just, oh, they get mad. But they got mad at Jesus for warning them. Jesus preached more in hell than he did heaven. Mm. You don't think they got mad at Jesus? During the last few months of his ministry, they wouldn't even allow him in the synagogues. Mm. Paul, they, hey, here comes Paul. They like a bar him from going into church. They get mad and stone him. Stone him. Stone him. The Holy Spirit will never take you off of truth and put you to somewhere where there's a little false doctrine. Amen. He said, I'll lead you to all truth. Not just some. My wife, that I want all the truth, not just some. My daughter, I want all the truth, not just some. Mm-hmm. We go in our house and we anoint that house. You know why? Because mm-hmm. demon spirits tried to come in. Mm-hmm. Oh, you don't Amen. believe there's demon spirits? You better wake up, buddy. Yes. Yes. Amen. They don't want you to believe they exist, but mm-hmm. behind every suicide, there's a demon spirit because a thief comes to kill steal and to destroy they think well if I kill myself I can erase all the no you just stepped over into hell and it's going to be something you cannot get out of there's people in hell right now wish they could commit suicide and get out of that pain but it's for eternity how can a loving God send someone to hell he doesn't they send herself God has made a way for us to prevent from going to that place all we have to do is say Lord Jesus please forgive me and accept him and say Lord I'm going to try I want to keep my faith in you when I fall down I'm not going to quit I'm going to get up I'm going to find new friends. I'm going to go to church, and I'm going to dig deep in the Bible. Amen. Amen. I'm going to lay that phone down, and I'm going to dig wow. deep. Yes. Amen. Frank, Amen. you know how when you start meddling in other people's business, you get that old long nose, and you start digging deep in their business, yeah. and boy, you just dig all long nose. You know, dig deep, dig deep in the Bible. Amen. Dig Amen. deep down in the Word of Almighty God. Amen. Praise God. God says, the day you seek me with your whole heart, mm-hmm. that's the day you'll find me. That's right. Amen. And he said, if you draw nigh to me, I'll draw nigh to you. Mm-hmm. If you draw nigh to him, he's going to draw nigh to you. Amen? Mm-hmm. Amen. Mm-hmm. Amen. If I draw nigh to Penny, she's going to draw nigh to me. Mm-hmm. Is that right with you, Shady? God said, if you draw nigh to me. Somebody says, well, I want to get closer to God. 
Tell him you love him. Amen. Amen. Wow. Go right to him. How? Mm -hmm. When you get down to pray, you don't have to go through a whole list of God, this, this, this. God already knows what you're going through. He's got every hair on your head number. He don't have any number. He's got every hair on our head number. Amen. When you get down and pray, you don't have to go through it. He knows what it is wrong with us. <laughs> He knows you're going through a battle. Yep. He knows you're going through something where you just feel like, oh, I can't take it no more, God. I feel like I'm going to explode. Mm -hmm. He knows that God helped me. Give me peace. Give me joy. Help me, God. God won't turn you away. Just like that thief on the cross. Yep. He said, Lord, remember me when you come into your kingdom. Jesus says, today, Amen. thou shalt be with me in paradise. Amen. Hallelujah, today. Mm -hmm. These people out here, some of these, yeah, when you die, you just go put in a casket and you lay there on the resurrection day. I said, your body does. No, you're everything spirit. No, it don't. I said, Paul said to be absent from the body if you're present with the Lord. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, you're with the Lord. Yep. When that heart stops beating, Angels give you an escort home. Mm. Amen. Don't take your body and put it in the board casket, put it in the ground. But let me tell you, like Trump said, this body's coming up out of that ground. Amen. That Amen. soul and spirit comes down and reunites. Yes. And bang, you mm. get a glorified body. That's mm. called the rapture. Yep. Amen. A lot of churches don't believe in the rapture. It's really the second resurrection. Jesus said one day there's coming called a great white throne judgment. All the dead. Those at the great white throne judgment, the only ones going to be there is those that did not accept and serve the Lord. They said the books was opened and the Lamb's book of life. Is your name in that book? Yes. 